everybody guess who I'm with? I'm with, well, who am I with? Oh, well, it depends, really. Um, Curtis Armstrong at the moment. But does it annoy you that people call you Booger? If it annoyed me, I'd be insane by this time. No, it doesn't annoy me doesn't at all. It doesn't annoy you? No. I, it's, a, it's a part I really like doing, and it never bothers me that people remember it. I'd rather that they do. All right. What are some of the things you're working with? Christine was telling us that you were working with her in a new movie that you just finished. I was just working so, with Christine and on Dan and 30. So, how nice is it to have a table next to her? All your friends are next to you. Not only that, we flew on the same plane, oh. sitting next to each other. Oh, good heavens. It was very nice. Yeah, we did this wherever it went. And um, I love that movie, Route 30. Oh, right. um, And, you know, you just do what you do. We, you know, I, I'll do a TV here, movie there, whatever. Has your passion for acting gotten stronger throughout the years? Like, is it more intense? Is it no, I wouldn't say consistent? it's consistent. It's consistent, you know. Is there any characters you'd like to act that you haven't, you haven't felt you've exploded enough? Uh, not really. I mean, I guess um, I used to do a lot more variety of things on when I did more stage work, which I don't do that much anymore. Theater. And, hmm? Theater. Yeah, theater. And uh, so I guess there would be, you know, if I had my way it would get to a point where I could go back and do more theater someday. But right now, it's just not practical. What about Broadway? Uh, I've never done Broadway. Uh, if there was something that was that worked out, it would be great. How do you deal if you do get something like a boring script, but with a famous director, and it's a really boring character, but you're getting paid a lot? How would you handle that? Would I'd you be able it. to? You'll take it. Yeah. But then how do you act a really... Boring, like you know, you don't feel you really acting. You just kind of like it's not a good character and it's not a good script. But you but, get I, but it's what I do for a living, so it doesn't matter whether it's absolutely brilliant or not. I still have to work. So you you would be able to somehow focus and yeah. do it. You have to. You have to. That that's a lot of work. <laughs> yeah, it. it I mean, n nothing is really easy, but it I if it's something that's terrible, you still have to somehow own it. And you do. Will you ever do directing or anything like that? Never. No? I'm never. not, I'm not, the, I don't have the temperament and I don't have the vision. Okay. I'm just an actor. You're just an actor? Yeah. A lot of barely people, that, actually. Barely? Why barely? I'm just kidding. <laughs> He's kidding. I'm kidding. I, I didn't really mean He's that. He's not really meaning that. Nobody means that, you know. A lot of people have been sitting around feeling kind of bored on the other side. Are you bored sitting here all day? Not bored. It's just actually by the end of the day, you're worn out. But yeah. I, I wouldn't say I'm bored, no. Okay. So you've been pretty good at this. Hi. All right. It's my first time. Well, thank you so much for being on the show. Would you be interested in saying hello to it? It's called Miss Divine's Tee Hee Hee Oh in French. If you could say Oh in French. But if you can't, that's okay. You can just say Miss Divine's Tee Hee. Hi, Miss Divine's Tee. It's Curtis Armstrong from New Jersey, and good night. And good night to you two folks, and stay in school. Thank you so much for your You're time. Welcome. I really appreciate it.